Okay, I'm gonna make just a quick video because I don't have a lot of room on my smartphone. Um, but this is the eighth day and um, my Buff Orpington that had been egg bound lost her ugly plug. It fell off today um, just a few hours ago because I checked it this morning and it was still there hanging there. It was really gross. It came off. Um, so I'm really pleased about that, but what next? Um, she survived for eight days after I had to perform um, basically a C-section to get two eggs out that um, she had laid in the membranes. You can go back and look at some of my previous um, uh, videos if I ever get those posted. Anyway, this is the plug. Um, I found it in her crate. The other black piece there is poo, but this is the plug. It's really gross, but you can see in there that it's hollow, if you would focus. And it's just like an umbilical cord is, you know, like a clump, it's a clump of dried tissue that was on her vent, and it basically, I let it dry out and it fell off today. It's, um, the white stuff is from basically what would be like chicken pea, um, that was on it, uh, dripping constantly. And she's still dripping. So, um, I'm going to turn it over. It's pretty, it is yucky, but for people who are interested in chickens, this, the yucky factor, probably you can get past it. Let's see if I can focus on there, finally. So you can see the hollow inside and all that hard stuff around it with the white on it was basically her insides that came out and there wasn't there were two eggs in there and I sliced them out and then there was just a bunch of yucky flesh purple flesh hanging and at first I was putting you know oil and anabasitracin on it and <clears throat> I decided to let it dry out like you would with a newborn baby's umbilical cord and just see if it would fall off here and expecting that it would be a failed and she would die within a day or two because she would try to lay an egg. But um, if she has tried to lay an egg, I don't know. Um, I've been keeping her in the dog crate in the laundry room um, <clears throat> and I've been keeping it dark. But if, you know, once a day, twice a day, sometimes three times a day, I take her outside for fresh air and a walk. And it was snowing just now and I took her out. She ate snow. She's still very active and has a lot of energy and she's looking around like she wants to fly a lot of times. She's eating um, and drinking and she's pooping now. The poops are coming out and there is some, I see some blood here, a little bit of dripping there. So um, yeah, so we'll just have to see what happens at this point in time. Um, She's going to have to lay an egg sooner or later, I guess. Um, but for now, uh, we're just going to take a wait and see like we've been doing. All right.